unbelievable. They're getting away with murder. A mid-Michigan family angered by the outcome of the Michigan Solicitor General's Flint water criminal investigation. It's been a little over a month since criminal charges were brought back, this time against nine former city and state employees. Two former top state health officials are charged with deaths connected to the crisis. Nine counts of involuntary manslaughter for nine people who died of Legionnaire's disease in 2015. Lori Kelly's mom is one of them. And new tonight, as our Ann Perrette shares, she believes the wrong people are being charged for her mom's sudden death. We know at least a third of the people represented in those nine involuntary manslaughter charges were treated at McLaren Flint, and their families are suing the hospital, saying they died because of the hospital's negligence. The state health department has confirmed the connection, saying from 2014 to 2015, during Flint's water crisis, 52 people contracted Legionnaire's disease because the bacteria was in the hospital's water supply. There's no trust at McLaren, there never will be. They killed my mother. I have no use for him. I need, I would like to see manslaughter charges just brought on whoever did the cover up. Every day is a battle for Lori Kelly, who lost her mom, her best friend to Legionnaire's disease on July 22nd, 2015. She was wonderful. Everybody loved her and she was smart aleck when she wanted to be. A little feisty thing. She was only, I think she said she could stretch to five foot. She was short. Short, but her daughter says Nelda Hunt was a fighter. She turned 80 years old exactly two weeks before she passed. It's the same day she checked into McLaren Flint. Kelly says the two had plans to go to lunch to celebrate that milestone birthday, but moments before she planned to go pick her up at home, she says her mom passed out. I got there as the ambulance was there and she went in McLaren and never came out. Kelly says her mom was treated about a week prior at the hospital for COPD. That wasn't unusual. She says Hunt received treatment for the chronic inflammatory lung disease yearly at McLaren Flint. But at the time, Kelly was not aware the hospital had the deadly Legionella bacteria in its water supply. I don't feel the people that are charged for manslaughter need to be charged. I feel it's McLaren higher up people for not disclosing what was going on. McLaren Flint has maintained the city's water source switch is to blame for the Legionnaire's disease cases at their hospital in 2014 and 2015. But in a letter we uncovered from the CDC, they state that the hospital has been a source of the bacteria since 2008, six years before Flint's water crisis. Coming up tonight at six, the hospital's detailed argument against the CDC. In Flint, I'm Ann Perrette, ABC 12 News.